Hello friends, welcome back to another solution video. In this video, I will be providing you the solution of Arcade Trivia March Week 1 Second Lab Validate Data in Google Sheets solution. And before starting the solution, I simply want to inform you that I already uploaded the solution of the first lab and you can access this from the playlist. And one by one, I will be uploading the solution of all the labs in this particular playlist. So please save the playlist and link of the playlist is in the description box. Now without wasting time, open the second lab. Start it, click on the start lab button and wait for the credentials to be loaded up. In this lab, we have to perform every task manually. That's why it's going to be a lengthier one. For us, a solution will be lengthy. Jayega, but many of you are actually starting to face the problem in the third task. That's why I am performing the solution. Once you get the credentials, you have to copy the project ID. Uh, you have to copy the password by clicking on this copy button. Then right click upon open Google Sheets and open it in incognito window. Incognito window may open karna hai. Email ID will be automatically given to you. So you have to click on the next button only and paste the password. It will ask you for the password. So paste it here and click on the next button. Click on I understand and you get logged in into the Google Sheets. Yes, instead of uh, working on the Google Cloud Console, this time we are working on the Google Sheets and the Google Drive. Once you get logged in, you have to simply come back to here, right click upon the task number one from the right panel and right click upon open on the rice bakery. You have to right click and open it in the incognito window. Okay. It will open a new Excel sheet for you. Once it get loaded, you have to click on the file button and have to make a copy of this file. Click on file, click on make a copy. And without changing the name, simply click on a make a copy button again. It will open the new tab for you with the copy of that particular Excel sheet. Now once the page gets loaded, you have to click on the item sheet from the bottom most. Aapko bottom mein, ek dam niche, aapko item sheet dik jayegi. You have to click on the item sheet from here. Click on got it. Now, first of all, you need to click on the view button and click on freeze, hover upon freeze and select one row. It will freeze the first row for you. Then select the row number C or the column number C, not the row number C, column number C. Then uh, you have to click on the uh, where it goes. Insert tab. Yes. Yes. Click on the data tab. And from the data tab, you have to click on uh, where it goes. You have to uh, apply a filter upon it. Yes. So click on the C, uh, column number C. Right click upon it. And once you right click upon the column number C, you will see other options. From here, you have to select sort sheet A to Z, okay, A to Z. It will sort the sheet. After that, you have to come back to here, scroll down, click on the check my progress and you will get the green tick for this task. Aapko yaha pa green tick mil jayega. Okay, green tick abhi nahi milega ki hume do task aur karne, sorry for that. You have to first of all click on the plus button and then you have to rename the sheet. So for that, you have to copy this name from the tab number 2, jo, test number 2 mein, or pointer number 2 mein jo name given hai, you have to copy this name. Copy it very carefully, come back to the sheet and from the bottom most click on the plus button. It will generate a sheet number 3. So right click upon this and click on rename and paste the name that we just copied. Make sure there should be no extra spacing in this name. Aapko ne bahut dhyan se copy karna hai name then hit enter button. Now come back to here and copy this formula for from the point in number 3. Copy it very carefully starting from the equals to, to, uh, to the bracket. Copy it, come back to here. Make sure your uh, column is selected as the A1. Then after the FX, you have to click here and paste the uh, formula that we just copied and hit enter button. It will load all the data for you like this. Now you can come back to the lab and click on the check my progress and now you will get the green tick. Ye wala task we missed kar tha. So we get the green tick now. So scroll down. Now for the second task, what we have to do, we have to simply click to here. Then we have to select this row. Then we have to click on the data. Then we will click on create a filter. It will create a filter for us and you will get a green icon like this, green filter icon. You have to click on this icon. Then untick this cinnamon bun. You have to untick this and click on the OK button. Come back to here, click on the check my progress, you will get the green tick here. Your assessment is completed. Now very carefully come back to here and click on this filter icon. It will remove the filter that we just created. Okay. Now what we do, we will simply click on the data button again and uh, we will create a filter it will create a filter for all then click on the cinnamon uh, click on this filter icon and this time we will again select the cinnamon bun and click on the ok button the same process we applied come back to here scroll down click on check my progress it might not give you the green tick yes you have to click on the data and you have to save it as the view so data view options and save it as a view so come back to here data save as filter view click on save once you are done with this, now we can come back to the lab and click on the check my progress in order to get the green tick. 
यू कैन सी असेसमेंट इज कम्प्लीटेड मोस्टली यहीं पर लोग को एरर आई थी इस वाई टास्क में बिकॉज थोड़ी सी चीज़ें यहाँ पर चेंज हो गई ओके वन सी आर डन विद दिस वी हैव टू डिलीट ऑल द व्यूज सो क्लिक ऑन डेटा व्यू ऑप्शन एंड डिलीट ऑल व्यूज सो कम बैक टू एयर क्लिक ऑन डेटा अगेन ऑन डिसमिस फर्स्ट क्लिक ऑन डेटा then we have the view options your view options and delete all view in tab it will uh, delete all the views we can come back to the lab now for the uh, task number 3 and the task number 4 what you have to do go to the description of the video and in the description you will find the link of this excel file ye maine drive pe upload kar diya so you have to access this drive file from the link in the description box and click on this and download this file make sure you save it in the local storage very properly jahan bhi aapko save karna hai so download karke save kar lenge then come back to here Now from here, make sure you select the items uh, sheet, the sheet number two. Go to the items sheet. Okay. Now from here, we have to click on the file button and click on import. We have to import that uh, same file that we just downloaded from the drive. Click on upload. Click on browse. Locate that file that you downloaded from the description box of the video. Uh, locate it and make sure the name of the file should be like this. Then click on the open button. Wait for it to get uploaded, and from this tab, you have to select Replace Spreadsheet and click on the Import Data. And once the data get imported, your lab would be finished. आपके सारे tasks complete हो चुके होंगे. So wait for this data to get loaded. Come to the lab, scroll down, scroll down, and one by one, you will get the green tick for both tasks. Task, task number three, click on this, you will get the green tick here. Assessment is completed. Now same for the task number four. Click on the check my progress and you will get the green tick here. You don't have to submit this. You have to option submit नहीं करने. Just click on the check my progress. Your lab would be completed. Now we are, we get the green tick for all the tasks. This one is remaining. Click on this. You get the green tick for all the tasks. Now once you get the green tick, your lab is completed. Congratulations. Now you can click on the end lab button again. Click on the end lab button once again. Give the star rating that you want to give. Click on submit button. and now come back to main page to verify whether we actually get the green tick in the lab or not lab kafi confusing ho chuki hai lekin yes and ek baar check kar lete hain so we get the green tick beside our lab it means we successfully completed this lab so if you like the video make sure you hit the like button hit the subscribe button if you have any query you can ask me in the comment box or on the whatsapp group thank you very much good bye